How's it going, guys? Doroface here. Welcome back to the World of Light Let's Play. Today we're going to be finishing clearing up everything just by finishing this lake, and that's all we have left to do. And then we'll go up there at long last and see what's behind that mysterious little doorway. And let's get right into it by seeing who this new fighter is. Link! Okay, that's... No, this is epic. Let's get him. And because, um, he... His... Since our spirit power is about three times his, we should just be able to chuck him off the stage and be done with it. Why don't you come over here, Link? Yaw. Scar. Bye. Have you enjoyed? And that was Link. Easy. Alright, so that's him done. And a lot of skill spheres as well. Let's continue. Snake Man? Oh, he's just Snake. Is that a joke? <laughs> snake Man? Slash man for the advantage, Victini for the power, let's go. Alright, this boy, he's, he's the snake man, so he's clearly going to be the strongest. Ready, what are these two doing? Let's work on the perfect shield, though. Oh no, it's a snake. Run, well, it's a- wait, what? Nice, you guys just got bomb chewed. Uh, no, I just got bomb chewed. Oh wow, it's just an ex super explosive match, literally. Ah, where's that bomb chew? Right, that's a lot of damage. Oh shoot, he's still alive. Oh shoot, I could die. Hey, we got a. We got the Snake Man. Clearly the most legendary spirit of them all. Let's continue. Alright, so let's finish the spirits on this side of the map by going into this boat and driving over to who this whoever this guy is. Fish. Okay, let's fight him. No spirit change needed. I bet we can win. Oh wait, and he favors neutral special, so he's just gonna be sucking us up. Oh, it is like an annoying time to battle. Oh yes, go down. <laughs> we fed the fish to the fish. Probably the best thing you can do, because it's the circle of life or something. Okay, mermaid. That should be easy enough. Let's use the fish. <laughs> Epic. Alright, it's the mermaid. You better run. Because they are truly the scariest thing. What are you doing? Why'd you just crawl back? Bye bye. Oh, look, they take gradual. Since it's an inkling, it takes gradual damage in water. So let's keep it in there. <laughs> I like the way the mermaid takes damage in water, it makes no sense. Come here, I have a back throw just for you. Oh, did you just knock me in the water? Okay, um, you just blew yourself up. Well done, Inkling. Or Mermaid, or whoever you are. Hey. Star Rod? Oh, the enemy starts battle with a Star Rod? No way. Empress Ball Blacks for the advantage. ho -Oh for the extra jump. That's great. Wow, 9,600 team power. I wonder when we'll hit the the quintuple digits. Alright, it is the Kirby. Ah, they're spamming their Star Rods at me. Thanks for the heal, bro. You get star rotted. Oh no, they're strong. Something. Boom! 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 Geyser! Bye! That's one down. Well, I mean two down, two to go. No, stop that. That's an annoying move, Kirby. Oh, 
Up smash, bye. Wow, that up smash that Lucas has is so good. Alright, first strike advantage. That's good. Because if you get the first hit, you'll turn invincible for a bit. And let's see what this little area is in the airport. Okay, so what is this area? Let's see. What? World Tour? Chun-Li, alright. Let's fight Chun-Li. Magalore for the advantage. Victini for the sheer power? Let's do this. It seems that we actually have some sort of world travel system, so that's cool. But will Chun-Li be strong enough to defeat us? Oh look, the jump power is down to emanate a Street Fighter match. Who could have thought? What are you doing, Chun-Li? You're not doing so good. You probably don't feel so good either. Oh shoot. Did you just try to, like, spike me? That's highly offensive. Hey. Boom. Boom fa. Get thrown. <laughs> that snake is so good for grabbing people. I can kill snake or snake man with snake. Oh, I can enhance her. She's going in the gym. <laughs> Excellent. Oh, so we're going here next. So where is that? Also, it's confirmed that World of Light takes place in Japan. Blanca. All right, this boy's strong. All right, uh, Mallow for the advantage. Bonus fruit for the stamina. Let's do this. This shall truly be a terrifying fight. Blanca! What even is that? Is it from Street Fighter? Oh, he has a screw- he has a screw attack. Come on, bro, it's just a multi-hitting down smash. Wow, that's- the screw attacks are powerful here. Boom! There we are. We got Blanca. Let's continue our little rampage across the world. It's pretty nice. Okay, what's next? Zangrief. No, Zangief. Whoa, this dude looks buff as hell. Empress Bullblax for the power. Victini also for the power. Let's fight it. Who is this man, and why is he so muscular? <laughs> Zangief. Have you seen this man? Oh, and I just realized, um, I thought that the, um, the fighter was slowed down. But then I remembered that little info tip that said that Incineroar is the slowest walker in the whole game. Which is a shame, but yeah. I guess what happens, happens. Alright, looks like we're about to get him, so like, 9,000 power, more like not. Oh no, he might have fight back. Oh, he gave fire to destroy a fire-type Pokemon, that makes sense. Zangief. So what does he do? Let's find out. Thank you for coming, I will toughen up your spirit. If I teach, if I teach style, you will notice powerful, strong arm effects. Grab range, grab power, throw power, and minus attack power, special move power, and item attack. Show me muscle power. Mwah -ha, come back later. Alright, who's next to fight me across the world? Oh, is this... Oh, Balrog. This boy looks buff. Let's fight him. Balrog. He will surely destroy us, because he is huge. Maybe, maybe, like, I'm pretty sure the, the minus the jump power indicates that this is from a different game. Like, a different fighting game. Because you, in most other fighting games that kind of cameo in this, yeah, um, there's usually, you know. Why don't we, uh, chuck a little Mac off the stage and see how he reacts? Bye! Of course, little Mac never recovers well, so that's a good strat.
Increase the power of neutral special moves. Okay, PK Freeze could be stronger. Nice. Let's continue. Alright, that's done. Where do we go now? Okay, we go across again. We're going all over the place. Vija. Alright, let's fight him. So enemy loves to jump, and all fighters have reduced jump power. And how does that work? Vija. Enemy does love to jump, doesn't he? He's just spamming the jump. I mean, it's kind of a disadvantage to him in general. You reckon you can use that attack on me? Because I disagree. Wow, he keeps just going for these weird little jump attacks. Oh. There we are. Good solid hit. Ooh, this boy knows how to attack. Get battered. Batman style. Yeah, that's my Jojo, Batman style. Oh, he's alive. That's a shame. I mean, we almost got him down. So that's welcome. But it happens. There we are, we got this boy down. Is this like a Street Fighter thing, by the way? Because, yeah, it's just a world tour of, like, some of the dudes that you'd probably find in a different fighting game. Right, that's done, so what's next? Across the world again. Who are you? Sagat. Huh. Enemy is super armor is... okay. We can just swap to the boss. The boss for the power. Hello for the extra jump. That's good. That's a good team. Sajat, you cannot make him flinch because of super armor. What do you think you're doing? Stop spamming Hadoken. Well, I'm too short for you to just do that. Oh, this dude's getting really on my nerves. Is he just... he's strong. Oh wait, but our down smash, since it doesn't... since he doesn't flinch, our down smash would be highly effective to deal with this boy. Damn it. No! Wait, PK Starstorm. PK Starstorm! Dun 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 dun. We got him with 3 HP left! Alright, who's next in this crazy world tour? Sajat is down, and he is with us now. Let's see. Oh yeah, secret area shows up. So who are you? M. Bison! Ooh hoo! Oh no. Alright, special moves have increased power and he reflects projectiles. Since he does that, I'm gonna swap to Marth, but let's check our other spirits. Do you know for the advantage? Marth, because he f smacks away projectiles, let's do this. I just buffed the heck out of Gino, so let's do this. Man, this dude is genuinely very strong. Like, halfway through the battle, he just gets stronger and you get weaker. Because he's so intimidating. How terrifying is this man? But yeah, at least I actually have my full power now, because of Gino being stronger. Ah. Ha! Ah. Hey, we gotcha. Well, now that Gino is just a little bit stronger, it makes all the difference. Oh damn. Not enough to kill though. And we got even with the counter. Let's get him out of here. Have you seen this man? Oh shoot. Hey, we got him with the counter! That was life or death just then. Alright, so we just unlocked VM Bison. Wait, and he gives PCI attack? Well, this dude's getting a buff because I use Lucas, so having a Psy attack is going to be incredible. A legendary sign. Alright, so is that it in this world map? 
Oh, it's, it's Ryu, isn't it? It's Ryu. This is gonna be cool. Swapping to Lucas, to Chayo, and Bison. Let's do this. Win the battle to awaken the fighter. Although it's a disadvantage, swapping to M. Bison just to try him out. Victini for the power. Let's do this. Spirit type disadvantage. That doesn't matter. All that matters is now we have a legendary spirit that also buffs Lucas. So that's actually insane. Ooh, street Fighter to Oh man, this dude's strong. Probably because he's Ryu. Oh wow, this dude is really strong. And for a moment I thought it was winning because of all the stamina battles we just faced in a row. Hey, you're probably out of here. We got Ryu! What, are we gonna unlock Ken as well, or are there no Echo Fighters in Spirit Mode? Alright, so we just got Ryu. That's incredible. Did we get Ken? Alright, so is Ken anywhere? Well, it looks like Ken's nowhere to be found. Alright then. Let's go back to the world map. Alright, now we can finally access that new area. Okay, so let's hit the switch and unlock the door to the fight to this new area, which is the only place we can go now. Because everything is done. I'll double check the entire place off camera to see if everything really is done. But if not, we are going to be going all the way back to this mysterious door that we were going to unlock all the way a long time ago. So I hope you all enjoyed this episode. If you did, please hit like and subscribe to see episode 21. The episode where we finally enter this mysterious door and find out just what's in it. Because it's open now, and it's right around the corner. So let's take a quick look at it. Well, here it is. Hope you all enjoyed, and I'll see you all next time. You can leave now.